This is a video on how to make a local archive copy of your Blackboard course. First thing to do is to log into your course and uh, roll down here. You want to click on Packages and Utilities, expand that, and then Export or Archive a Course. Clicking on that, exporting a course brings over the content without the students. Archiving brings all of the student content. So we'll click on Archive Course. We want to calculate the size, that's pretty important. It looks like it's going to be 250 megabytes. You have to decide if you have enough room on your hard disk. If you want to include all the Grade Center history, it does increase the size. Uh, it's better not to check that one because then it doesn't include all the stuff of the student's uh, prior submissions if they have multiple submissions. Click on Submit. It takes it back to this page. It shows you that an action has been queued and we uh, wait for three to five minutes and then we click on refresh and it will refresh that page and there's the archive and then in an effort to download that we click on open and it will download that archive file it's in the compressed format it's 225 megabytes and even on a high speed line it says it's going to take about 14 minutes uh, once it's finished you can go to the uh, folder where these this course is being downloaded and it'll look uh, like a zip file once it's finished so after 15 minutes of downloading this file is nearly here and you see it shows up as a zip file and that zip file has all the content for the course it's in a compressed format it's much better if you need the content to grab it directly from the open course to go into the weeks themselves and there you go.